Testing. Stopping. Testing, testing one, testing six, testing eleven. Mate, mate, you don't need to worry. I've got it all under control with my my fob here. You might not know what a fob is, but that's okay. What in the world? That's okay that you don't, because you don't have to. You can use fobs without knowing what they are. It's quite all right. They're not dangerous at all. So what I've done now is I've rearranged all the things. As you can see, hi Xauts. Hi mate, Amargo. Amargo. And most importantly, hi Sarzor. How did you get a crown? Oh, Twitch Prime. That's cool. Congrats on the crown. So I'm going to appear right now. Ta -da! Da -da 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 -da! Okay, so I've appeared, so that's pretty cool. And now I'm going to move over. Oh yeah, then I'm going to enlarge, enlargen. 
which I'm doing. So we can see there's a bit of a glowy green. That's too bad. What can I do about that? So I'm actually going to use this as the new view, if you know what I mean, in terms of the other one with the giant chess pieces was like an interim view. So by moving this dial, I can make that go away. Uh, the lighting is still so poor. We need to improve that. Yes, I have a large arm. Okay, in the summer it will be better. But I live in the Northern Hemisphere, which means it is currently winter. Okay, so what we're doing today, guys, is we're celebrating a thousand subscribers on the YouTube channel. There's only one problem. Um, we don't have a thousand subscribers. <laughs> so that's where you come in. <laughs> That's where you come in. Welcome, welcome everyone to Chesmas TV episode 321. Today is time for me to plug my headphones in. Where do my headphones go? Right here. There we go. Now we can enjoy sound. Welcome, welcome everyone to Jasmine's TV episode 321. I have appeared. Today is December 31st, 2016, the last day of the last year of your life that is currently this year. Today we are going to celebrate a thousand subscribers on YouTube, which is our goal, and a thousand followers on Twitch. There's only two problems with the celebration. First of all, uh, we don't have a thousand subscribers, and, and secondly, we don't have a thousand followers. So let's go take a look and see exactly how well we're doing in... Uh, in YouTube, as you can see, I'm floating above the screen, and we have 990 subscribers. That's 10 shy, so we need 10 more subscribers. We're going to be getting those during the episode because I'm a man of faith. We're just going to believe that. And on the Twitch channel, let's go over to Twitch here and see how we're doing. Hmm, how many followers do we have? Let's bring up the chest while we're at it, right? So we're celebrating, celebrating things that aren't happening. It's kind of... Play chess. Let's play one plus four. Let's play rated chess because I like chess because that's the kind of people we are. Uh, where does it show followers? Right there at the top, right? Followers, 922. Okay, we're not celebrating 1,000 followers. We haven't got them, but that's no problem. It's really the subscribers that we're, that we're celebrating. And it's very, very important that we hit 1,000 subscribers today. If we do not, I'm going to look stupid, and that is simply not acceptable. So here we go, a game against Luca FM. So first of all, have you subscribed is the first question. And then let's jump over to get in, get in the link right here. If you haven't yet subscribed to the YouTube channel and you're watching on YouTube right now, what? I realized why. It's because when you're a YouTuber, you need to say, please subscribe to the YouTube channel every other sentence. Please subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way people are reminded to please subscribe to the YouTube channel because if they don't, they're watching the video, they're like, please subscribe to the YouTube channel. And they might actually close the video without subscribing to the YouTube channel, which could be bad. Um, so I need to remind you to subscribe to the YouTube channel. Hopefully you're doing that right now. I've noticed that some people like say that every sentence and it becomes obnoxious. So so yeah, I'm obnoxious now. Get over it. But subscribe to the YouTube channel. Um, but now that you're watching this on YouTube, we already have a thousand subscribers, so it's not nearly as important. I think D5 is my move here. Not nearly as important. If you are watching live on Twitch, however, which I'm looking at you, Kaffer John, we need a thousand subs. We need this. There's nothing I've needed more right in this moment except a banana. And in order to get that, I need your help. So here's what you got to do. You got to create 10 emails, 10 Gmail email accounts. They're very easy to make. Um, you don't even have to do much, just become a human, because there is like this robotic captcha, which will catch you if you're not um, a human. Should I play bishop e6? I don't know, maybe I should play queen e7. Hmm, if I play queen e7, I'll lose my knight. I don't want to lose my knight. Maybe I should play knight e7. Oh, if I do that, that would be moving my knight backwards. That's not very good. Hmm, 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 I think I'll just play knight e7. Because then I'll castle, and then I'll put my rook right here. And then I'll take his queen. That's how it's going to work. Okay. 
So. Oh, I didn't castle. I have a short, short-term short memory, uh, which means by the time I've finished my sentence, I've forgotten what the first half was. It causes some of my sentences to come out sounding a little weird, uh, but, the, but on the other hand, on the other hand, I have a wristwatch, so that helps. That's the kind of thing that happens, by the way. By the time I got to other hand, yeah, the sentence was, I had had an all new meaning, which is nice. It's just nice. It keeps things interesting. Okay, so my rook is going to take his queen here. We're ready for that. Let's play c6 first. Let's see how many subscribers we have now. Oh boy, it's all scrambled up and I can't see how many. 990 still. Okay, that's not good. That's not good. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. I don't know if you can hear that, but I can hear it. It's a chess was talking in my own ear. So Luca says he's only subscribed twice. That's not very good. So we are celebrating 1,000 subscribers. Uh, the reason I purchased an extremely loud keyboard is so that when I'm streaming and typing, you can feel like you're involved even though you can't see anything that's going on. You're like, What's that sound? It sounds like he's being attacked by a 1,000 piranha. Um, it's actually a thousand subscribers and uh that's that's just you know to keep you involved right there because i was just typing a message so that's message is now complete what am i doing i don't know i'll play this move okay so my chest isn't that good but that's okay everyone who's watching is currently subscribed that's not good i guess there are 990 subscribers but there is someone who hasn't subscribed yet. In fact, there's 10 people, and we need to make this happen. Do you know what's going to happen if we don't? Oh, that is a cool-looking knight, bro. Really cool. Really, bro. Um, That's my move. What do you think? Oh, yeah. Rook b8, because rooks love to defend pawns that are straight in front of them. Because rooks, they, they you know, they're nearsighted. If your rook is all the way across the board from something, it's like, what is that down there? Is that, is that something on my glasses? I can't quite see it. And they take their glasses off and they and they clean them. It's bad because rooks need to be ready for battle. I've lost a pawn. I'm going over here now. Like this rook right now. He's like, what is that? Is that the king? Are you in check? I think you have to get out of check. I, I think that's a king. But if a rook is like right in front of your pawn, that is so good. You should move all of your rooks right in front of pawns. Oh, wow, you still have them. Okay. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to my own YouTube channel. This chess game's going pretty badly. So I'm going to invent some winning moves here. You like these moves? I think they're pretty good. Now I'm going to hit the exchange. Great work, Chesswiz. Great work. Hmm. I guess I can't win this way. Oh, I can win this way. Perfect. Perfect. Mm, now I'm going to win super big. So I win this game as usual. That's pretty normal for me. Play here. The pin is nice, but he'll just move his king out, and then I have to fight his king. Rooks can't fight kings very well. So they, they can take pawns, though, really, really well. Like, if a pawn is on the seventh rank, it's kind of like those corn on the cob things where you're just like, well, I have loud teeth. And, and you just eat all the pawns. That's what it's like. Seventh rank is the perfect rank for rooks. They just eat all the pawns. The other really, really, really good thing about rooks on the seventh rank is that they pin the enemy king back like this. So he can't move here, here, or here because of my uh, awesome condition right now. It's actually a medical condition. It's called rook on the seventh. And so his king cannot participate uh, in anything, which is great for me because I don't want him to participate. Hmm. This is kind of funny, I think. 
I'm laughing. Sarsor says that seventh rank is the only good rank is not the only good rank. He likes the second rank. That's stupid. That's just stupid, Sarsor. And if I weren't so polite, I would tell you that that is just stupid because the second rank is this is your own rank. You think that the second rank means the second, the rank with the two on it, right? This one right over here. What's happening? Why doesn't this draw? Oh, I can't draw and there's no two either. It's cut off. That's weird. Um, checkmate. Hmm. Uh, there is a two. It's just, somehow it's cut off the board. Let's see if I can fix that. Two. Yeah, that two right there. You see that two right there? That is not the second rank. The second is from always from your own perspective. So your pawns always start on the second. Enemy pawns always start on the seventh, even if you're black. Now I know the world is a lot different if you're black. I've never personally experienced it. However, the second rank is still your side. So there, that's true. Now we are celebrating a thousand subscribers and we don't have a thousand subscribers. So we really, really need your help to subscribe on YouTube. And that is happening right now. You're, you're helping right now. Let's play another game of chess. That was a fantastic game of chess, by the way, because it included me winning at the end. That was great. Celebrate, woo, woo, thousand subs. You know how long I've been streaming chess? Years and years. A thousand subscribers is just a drop in the bucket. The goal is a million subscribers before I die. So this is just the first milestone on that journey. So let's put this on the screen now. Firefox. Okay, you can see the chat. Okay, so now we're going over here. Then we're going to refresh this. And then we're going to go over here. 990. Do you see that? Do you see that right there? Then we're going to... You don't see it. There. See that up there? Now you can see it. Man, it says 990. That is not cool, guys. We need 1,000, not 990. We need 1,000. Get out of here, Chess Whiz. Now it's broken. No, I'm playing chess with the same guy. And I can't. Oh, what's happening? Is it back? Yes, now it's fixed. Okay, cool. Um, now it says 900 and... 90. So the only problem now is that it doesn't say a thousand. We're celebrating a thousand subscribers today. How many times am I going to say that? It needs to happen today. Now that I guess I could say that, well, it's just going to happen by the end of the day. First, you guys have to watch this video and then you're going to subscribe. But oh, oh there is a scary area. Hmm. I like that because scary rhymes with airy. Should I push? Should I play bishop e3? Kind of lame spot for the bishop. Yes. Lame is my middle name. I don't go by my full name very often because chess lame whiz is kind of lame. But the reason they call me lame is because I have no legs. So that's pretty reasonable. Every now and then I mention that on the stream just so you don't know what to believe. Because what if I throw out my real name and, you know, and, and then I don't want you to believe that. So I need to be lying constantly just to disguise the truth. You know what I mean? It's an important skill. Okay, which way is he going to castle? If he goes over here, that'll be interesting. But if he goes over here, that'll be doubly interesting, like twice as interesting. I think I'll take the queen. So, recommend that ChessWiz continues streaming forever. That's what it looks like to me. It actually says in the chat, how about a stream until you have a thousand subscribers? But apparently that's forever because so far in 10 minutes, I have achieved, or 15 or even 20 minutes, I have achieved zero new subscribers. So if we extrapolate that, that means in 24 hours, we will have zero new subscribers. And if we stream for one year, we will have zero new subscribers. So extrapolating that out, it's a forever stream. We never get subscribers. It sounds bad for your health, actually. I don't know if I want to do that. Oh, this is great. Why am I down a piece? How did that happen? Man, I need to pay attention to the chest. Where's my scroll wheel? How come it's not scrolling? Okay, so this part looks good. I still have pieces here. It looks good. I still have pieces here. I still... Oh, no! He took my bishop! Okay, so now I know I'm down a piece. That's great. I can still win this, though. Because this king is over here. I'll just checkmate it. 
What do they? Oh, because I was after to checkmate kings. That's what I need to do right now. I think I should just lose this pawn. I think I'll just lose the G pawn. I don't need it anyway. So what I'm hearing is that YouTube has a large delay now in its subscriber indicator. That could make it difficult. That could make this really difficult. Oh, I see what's going on. I see why everything's cut off. There's a scroll bar. There's a scroll bar on my chessboard. I wonder why that is. It's kind of weird. It's not good. Ah, oh. down a rook now. Still looking bad. Go to your subscription page instead of looking at the count on your main page. Hmm. What's my subscription page? Hmm. Hmm. What's a subscription page? I need to capture a couple of knights and pawns. I'm down two knights and two pawns. That's eight points worth of material, which is roughly a queen. So this is not good. But don't worry, I can still win. I have a rook on the board. Rooks can checkmate. So we're, we're pretty much there. What's a subscription page, Sarsor? What is that? I don't know what that is. Oh, that's all. Checkmate, Luca FM. I'm such a chess player. I got rooks. You got checkmate. That was excellent. Oh, I just love chess, especially when you win. So studies show that when you win, you feel better than when you lose. I studied it myself and I showed it. So that is true. I'm ready to play a game where I don't super, 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 super lose in the middle game and then win anyway. I'd rather have a game where I'm just really, really smart. So what I'm going to do is take this variant mode and change it over to King of the Hill chess because King of the Hill chess, if you get your king to the center, you win, which means there is no end game. So that's going to help me, I think, because by the time I get to the end game, I'm missing some of my horses and some of my castles. So if I, if I um, don't get there, then obviously I won't be missing those. So that, that should work. Um, so what's a subscription page? On my channel, click on subscribers at the top next to my videos. On my channel, click on subscribers at the top next to my videos. Okay, let's see. On my channel, I'm there. Click on the top. Which, which end is the top? Hmm. Subscribers at the top next to my videos. Subscribers at the top. Oh, I can't do this. It's too hard. Oh, it's just you. Someone says the stream is lagging. Is the stream lagging? I'm not dropping any frames. My universe is fine. Maybe it's all the Bitcoin miners in the universe slowing down the matrix. YouTube.com slash subscribers. Really? Let's try that. Let's try that. Okay. So now we're playing some King of the Hill chess. If you get your king to one of these four center squares without cheating, you win. That'll be great. Okay, so I have... Oh, look at that! Wow! What a great page. I didn't know that page existed. And... There's a lot of subscribers, so we need to, we need to, mm, 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 look at this, look at this. Whoops, who are, who's that? As he's a subscriber, but I didn't mean to reveal his identity like that. Where are we? We're right there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Sorry, I'm using all my chess time making this say subscribers 994. We're almost there. Guys, we're almost there. We need a thousand so we can celebrate. I have a huge glass of wine here that I'm drinking because it's a celebration. Mm. But we have to get the rest of the way. Is this that same awful opening? It's the same awful opponent. Luca FM is back. Oh. Okay, I have a strategy. It's called checkmate. It's going to work this time. Uh, this is the same, but the difference is severe, which is this center stuff with the king. If you get your king there, you win. So the new strat is to just move the king there. He has a center pawn and I don't. Mm, that could be a bad thing in this opening. Let's trade queens. Oh, I'm going to lose my knight. Great. This is perfect. This is my style. Hang your knight, then win. Okay. So we're on to step two now. We are on to step two. How many subscribers do we have now? 994 again. Come on, guys. You want the stream to end, don't you? It's not going to end till we have a thousand. 
My king is almost there. One more square. Hmm. I guess I'll go back. Because I don't like that to be check. Okay, so now I've lost a piece. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so here's the plan. G5, which will distract him. He'll say, oh, squirrel! And he'll take that pawn. Then I'll take this. And then he'll be flabbergasted by my ingenuity. Hmm. No, then he'll take this, huh? Let's trade rooks. More trades, more good for me. Hmm. I have to devise the perfect trap that could catch even a bear. Like a bear trap, for example. That's what I need to devise here. Just for example. Let's go after that bishop. If I could take that bishop... Then I can move right here and win. All right. Oh, yay. This is going to work. Mm -hmm. It's a two mover. Just move one is take the bishop. Move two is win. Yes. I love plans that require two moves because I can store the entire plan in my brain. That's about the most number of moves I can store. So it's perfect. Come on, subscribe. Come on, subscribe. Come on, subscribe. We're celebrating a thousand subscribers, and I hate looking like a doofus. I just hate it. So now we have 994 subscribers still. Come on, guys. I'm going to subscribe to myself. I have six emails. I can do this. Come on. You need a link? I put it in the chat. You know why he's taking so long? It's because I'm winning this right now. Oh, you're out of time. Oh, no, I can't catch that bishop now. It's so speedy. Okay, so the plan is the bishop can only move to these squares, and I'll take it on any of those squares, including this one by the knight, this one by the knight, this one by the king, this one. Oh, I can't get it there. Hmm. So maybe rook here. That's not the color I want. Ooh, look at that color, right? That's pretty good. That'll attack the bishop, and the only place he can go because of these dangers is right here. So at that point, what will I do? Maybe my rook will then go up here. Will that work? Let's find out. Who cares? Thinking two moves ahead, that's hard for you. But I don't need hard. Ooh, I win. Good game! Good game, Kaffer, whatever your name is. Luca. Kaffer and Luca are very similar because they both consist of letters. So I pretty much got your name right. That was a great game. He says KK, so I'm going to send him a smiley face, but I'm going to send it backwards because I'm feeling kind of backwards today. That was great. That was great. Now that I've won three games in a row because I'm just a perfect chess player, I'm going to show off my skills with anti-chess. In anti-chess, you try to lose all your pieces in order to win, and I am super good at that. As you can imagine, I mean, did you see the way I was playing? I was basically losing all my pieces in those games, and it wasn't even anti-chess. So in anti-chess, I'm twice as good at that. Oh, great. Now we're playing against this guy. Fum. I don't know if I can beat him. Come on, subscribe. Come on, subscribe. Have you subscribed to the channel yet? Oops, that's a losing move. Okay, so in anti-chess, Ivor is a losing move instantly, but fortunately he doesn't know what he's doing, and he has given me a recovery mode. So he, I don't know if he knows the rules here, so let me ask him, do you know the rules? He might not know if that says, do you know the rules, but if he doesn't, that's his problem. That's not a very good move. Let's play this. <laughs> um... Yes, yes, Luca, it is anti-chess. Uh, that's that's basically what I told you here. It's not quite in English, but it's not in French either, so I hope it didn't confuse you. Um, I'll take with a queen, because I'm not very good. Taver John wants to know how many moves I can see ahead when I'm really, really focusing. Caffer John, when I'm focusing, I can see into the next chess game. It's not like I get to checkmate and I stop seeing. I am so, so seeing, if you know what I mean, that it's like, sometimes I can see two games away. I'm like, okay, so I can see this game ends in checkmate, and then in the next game, I'm going to get scholars mated. And then two games from now, it looks like a very interesting position. So I'd say about 90 
90 to 100 moves ahead when I'm really focusing. But I've only focused once, and that's when I was uh, inside of a Ford Focus. It was very, why did he resign? I'm, I'm, I'm so good. He just gives up in the, the very beginning. Well, let's play one more anti-chess. So I'm obviously the best at anti-chess. Uh, we have 994 subscribers. I'm now refreshing that right there. And now we have 994 subscribers, which is awful. We're stuck here streaming. I need you to subscribe. Today we are celebrating a thousand submarines, and that is a big deal because we're about to nuke Russia. I'm just kidding. I would never nuke Russia because I don't have any nukes. Obviously. I mean. Okay. Now we're playing Program Fox. He's a 2253. And I'm covering up his time with my subscribers button. There we go. Subscribers, 994. Are you subscribed? No. Click the link in the chat. You can subscribe right now. The perfect move is queen g4. This is going to be a tough anti-chess game, by the way. Program Fox, he's a good player. And so if you've never seen anti-chess before, you're about to. It's a must-capture game, by the way. If there's something you can take, you have to take it. So here in this position, I have to play one of these, well, sorry, one of these two moves. It's my only legal moves right now. And my choice is this one. This one. There's a question, if I had nukes, would I nuke Russia? I think it's hard to tell because uh, Russia would hear me telling. Then I might get nuked, you know? Interesting. Very interesting. Let's do this. So I'm not going to tell. But if I had enough nukes, hmm, that's a chin stroker for sure. If I had enough nukes, I don't think I would nuke Russia. It's too dangerous. Considering this guy is a 2253, I'm actually 2254. I'm just slightly underrated right now. My, my approximate strength, however, is 2254. That would be why I'm winning right now. You can tell I'm winning because I have the most rooks. In anti-chess, count the kings and the rooks, and whoever has the most wins. And you can see we each have one king, which is the proper quantity. But rooks, I'm ahead by one, so I'm, I'm winning here. Okay. Interesting move. I could play this. Which would be a winning move. Watch me win. Okay, so now h4, pulling the queen out, and then when his queen is out here, he's going to take all my things. I play here. This is so winning. Then I play here. Oh, I'm a genius. I'm a genius of epic proportions. I'm not like a small genius. I'm a huge genius right now. Then I play here. Oh, have you ever seen a genius like this genius? You haven't actually seen me, though. You've just seen a digital representation. Look at these rooks. They're so smart. Oh, I can hardly stand myself. Oh, if only I thought of other people as highly as I thought of myself. Checkmate to you. I just beat Program Fox. I have won every game this episode. The only area that I'm failing is that I still don't have a 1,000 subscribers. Other than that, I am a champion of the universe. I've done everything that I've tried to do today. <sighs> Except for eat chocolate-covered raisins. Hold on a sec. Do you see these Kirkland Signature chocolate-covered raisins? They're mostly gone because I don't have a lot of self-control. I'm not going to eat these until we hit 1,000 subscribers. So this is on you now. We need 1,000 subscribers. And as you can see above me here, we only have 994. Let's refresh that. Oh, look at that. Now we have 995. Yes, 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 yes. Why? 
that's great because it means like another hour and a half we're gonna be a thousand this is great okay let's play with another friend i have a couple more friends left here uh the variant is going to be atomic because atomic chess is fun you just blow things up this is very fitting on our previous topic about nuking russia because oh, i want those raisins so bad man if self-control had mass it actually weighed and then you put me on a scale you'd be like huh this guy doesn't weigh very much. Actually, you could do that today, and it would be definitely true. But it would be also true in that reality where self-control had mass. Because when when chocolate-covered raisins are out of reach, there's only one thing I do. I stand up, and I go get them, which is what I just did. And I bring them within reach so that I can gaze upon their lovely, lovely visage, which is a great word, visage. It's so good. You should use that word more often. If you want to appear sophisticated and 400 years old, you should say visage. Hmm. Is this the right move? Is this the right move? Hmm. Hmm. This is a trap. I just know it. It's a trap. Actually, he's 1500, so it's not a trap. It's a blunder. Kiriako says, do you want me to make six more accounts and subscribe to you? No. If you did that, I'd have 1,001 subscribers. That is not the goal. That is not the goal. Hmm. Oh, that was some great water. You could hear it going down. You know what it is? It's, it's water. I told you it was wine, but that's because I'm a liar. Okay. This is atomic chess. You can see these weird moves. You can definitely tell it's atomic from that. In atomic chess, when you capture something, you blow up. So that's why I don't take anything in atomic chess. I value my self. So that's the way that works. Oh, did you see that? Do you hear that? He goes here and it blew up this and it also blew up his knight because everything nearby blows up unless it's a pawn. So, but pawns that do the capture. I mean, the, the pieces that are involved in the capture, they always blow up. So that's a lot of blowing up. You got to be careful in atomic chess. So my plan now that that's happened is I'm playing here so that he can't move here and cause damage to my king. He would blow himself up if he moved there. He says, I hate variants. So I'm going to send him a heart because he is feeling a little sad. Now I'm going to send him another heart, S2. This is a great heart because it, it has a little base, if you know what I mean. So it doesn't fall over. And then I'm going to send him a... Oh, uh, never mind. I was going to send him an ice cream cone, but I see he already has one. So I'll play knight here. Then I'll play knight here, no matter what he does. And then I'll take this blowing up his queen. Sound good? Looking forward to it. Oh, he's going there. Okay, so perfect. Let's go get his queen. Mm -hmm. If he blows himself up here, then my rook is cleared to blow up his king. And that's actually checkmate. You can just capture something next to the king and his king is gone. Yeah, it's quite the variant. It's not really chess at all. Hmm, queen there. Mm -hmm. Let's play this. I could play my knight to this square. That would be pretty fun. Oh, he blew himself up with that move. Okay, so let's let's block that hole up. Well, let's play the knight here. I, I think it's really funny because if he takes me, he's going to blow up all of his things, which he just did. So that was a great demonstration. Now I'm going to come down here and checkmate him. Variants are great because they're not chess. And in chess, I lose all my pieces. But in variants, it's actually kind of good sometimes to lose all your pieces. So this is just fantastic. So let's just play here and let him take my queen. Uh, that would be a trade. Now it's my turn. Perfect. Okay, so I have a lot more pieces on the board than he does, and in this case, this could actually be good. <clears throat> a random chess player has wandered in, and he's literally a random chess player. His name is A Random Chess Player, which is a great name. And I'd like to tell him, I have a message for you, random chess player, and my message is as follows. Subscribe to the YouTube channel today. We are celebrating 1,000 subscribers, except we don't have them, so you can fix that, please. Uh-oh. That's the winning move right there. Oh, I almost had to eat my fingernail for a moment. Checkmate. Boom, I blew up your king while I was in check. Wow, that's the only time we're going to do that today. And we've got a challenge here from Hakon GM. He's another atomic player, so I guess maybe we'll blow up one more king while being in check. But this will be the last one. 995 subscribers. Let's give that a refresh and see how many we have now. Mm-hmm-hmm. <laughs> Mm -hmm. It's going to be... Oh, this is exciting. Oh, how many do we have? Uh, 995 still. Mm. <clears throat> That's not very good. 
I need you to subscribe. I put a link in the chat. We're trying to hit a thousand subscribers. We started this episode with less than a thousand. We're ending with exactly a thousand because these chocolate covered raisins are waiting for you. You can see how they're cut off. They're that, they're that eager. Let's go like this from this side so I don't look like a dork. Mmm, don't those look good? You can't have any because I can't send them through my computer to you, but if I could, I still wouldn't because I want to eat them myself, but I can't because we need a thousand subscribers, and this is where you come in. If you would please click the link in the chat. It's at youtube.com slash TV, and you go there, and then what happens next? You click on that button that says subscribe. That would be so, so, so great. Of course, I need to do that with all six of your emails, but no big deal. You could do that. Mm, this is powerful, this opening right here. Because if he takes me, whoosh, and I blow up his king. Oh, I missed a good move. I missed a good move. And it's been put in the chat now. So in this position, I could have played check. He needs to block that. And then queen d5 right here, threatening to come in here with checkmate. Also threatening to blow that up with checkmate. Double checkmate, triple checkmate. It'd be checkmate all the time. I should have done it. Nice find. But <clears throat> I'm still winning. Definitely winning here. This move is very, very, very deadly. Uh, he takes me, but then I just come in like this check. And from there, it's tough for him. I could also play e5. It looks kind of silly, like, well, you you can just be taken, but actually, just going to block that. But actually, advancing your center pawns until they can't move anymore is a great strategy in atomic chess, which is why I am doing it. Yeah, so this is very, very dangerous for him now. I'm going to come in here with check. He's going to lose his queen, then he loses his king, then he loses his rooks. It'll be pretty bad. Come on, guys. Pistachio83 unsubscribed. That's not good. Let's see how many we have. Check. Okay, he blew himself up like a maniac. Let's take this. I think this is going to be check. Very exciting. Yes, this is exciting. <laughs> this is pretty funny. Of course he can't take me. He'd blow himself up. So what does he do? But if he runs in the corner, he'll blow himself up. So now, e5, critical, critical moment here. And he blows himself up. So this is a winning move right now. His king is ensnared by his own ensnarement. And I am about to win. This, this is great. This is so great. Look at that. We have a challenge from Link. Okay, so it's wonderful that you guys want to play any chess. I mean, atomic chess. But what I really, really want to do right now is refresh that button and see a thousand subscribers. So if you could please subscribe to the YouTube channel. Boom! There goes your king. Ah, uh, that'd be great. We are celebrating 1,000 subscribers today. I'm playing Hecon again. But I don't want to be a... A thing with a thing, so. Oh, I don't want to play any more Atomic. What am I doing? C3. Now that is a weird move. Is this for Queen A4? Is this some kind of secret... Secret plan? Please do, Sarsor. Please do tell your mom to subscribe. That'd be great. Oh! <gasps> Oh, this is so exciting. Thank you for 999. This is so exciting. Um, I'm going to decline this challenge from Link because we don't have time for another game. Only one more subscriber and we're going to have our thousand. Yes. So how are we going to hit 2000? The goal was 1000 in 2017-16, which is this year. And the year is over today. So the way we reached our goal today was simply by streaming until we... Ooh, reach the goal. But next year, it might not be too easy to hit... Three. The goal is 3,000 next year. We're going to triple our subscriber count to 3,000. The way we're going to do that is as follows. We're going to add some cool new things to the show. We're going to remove some stupid things. You notice Rondep's not in the chat right now. And, and we're going to combine those together. I'm just kidding, Rondep. I really love you. And I, I shouldn't have made that joke at your expense. I feel guilty now. First time since 2003. Oh, White resigns. Why did you resign? Because you have no queen, maybe. Oh, but I've got a challenge from Luca. I would just really love to play him. You can't see that, unfortunately. So I'm going to decline that. So let's see if we have a thousand subscribers right now. A thousand and one. We have a thousand and one subscribers. A thousand and one. Celebrate! Celebrate! Yay! Ah, oh, these are so good. Um, oh, oh, chocolate cover raisin. Mm. 
Y'all still have to eat some more. I have to eat a thousand of them, right? To celebrate a thousand of them. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Mm -hmm. yeah, too bad I can't send them to you. If I could send these to you, I would right now. I'll just email them to you. Mm -hmm. I'll have to fax them. Then. I got rid of my fax machine. Mm -hmm. My fax machine? I was faxing. Hold on. Hold oh, on, I'm trying to be polite. I was. Oh, I hit the number. There we go. 1001. That's quite. I was. I was back. Somebody was really hungry. I was on the phone with him. I was like, dude, I'm so hungry. I'm like, I'm eating a banana. And he's like, send them out me. I'll fax him to the banana. That's why I don't have a fax machine anymore. Okay, this is our celebratory game. We're going to play Die Gorovich. It's the last game of the show. <clears throat> oh, those are so good. Oh, especially with a thousand subscribers. Great. So I'm not kidding, actually, because I never am. Next year, in 2017, we're going to hit 3,000 subscribers. And I'm not really sure how, but it's going to involve you subscribing. So if you haven't subscribed yet, which is just a shocking, amazing thing, because you have amazing will of steel. Oh, I need to play faster. This guy's a crazy, crazy, crazy man. Whoops, that's not the right move. Oh, thank you. Let's throw that away. His king's in the center, so I'll just go checkmate it. Royal Fort coming up. Oh, he, he guarded himself. <clears throat> Oh no, Chess Whiz, that's a stupid ending. But it's actually a very fitting ending to the show because you know what? When Chess Whiz plays chess, he gets checkmated. Oh, didn't I win every chess game, every game, except for this game, which I should have won because I've got seven. You can't see the time on the clock anymore, but I've got seven seconds on my opponent's clock and 13 on mine. So there were so many good ways to win this chess game, but Bishop H5 was not one of them. I actually chose one of the ways to lose. That's awful. So this is the new view, guys. Um, chess Whiz TV view. And it says buy. So the way I leave now is the way I leave is I click this thing that makes me disappear. Are you ready for this? So next episode, we're going to play a new variant that you've never seen before, as always. It's called Forwards Chess. It's where you can only move forwards. And we're hoping that the subscriber count also can only move forwards because I have a sneaking suspicion that someone subscribed five times. And if they unsubscribe and we go back below a thousand, I'm going to be so mad. I'm going to regurgitate those chocolate cover raisins. It's awful. Please don't do that. But yes, next year, we are going to hit 3,000 subs. And next episode, we are going to play Forwards Chess. Check it out tuesday at 4 p.m gmt which is 45 minutes ago if you're watching live 45 minutes ago on tuesday looking forward to that this has been chess with tv thanks for watching I would just like to say thank you, all of you guys who tolerated my incessant nagging. These raisins are so good, I'm still eating them. About subscribers, it's I actually don't like to do that, to push anything. You might notice, like, I don't say support me on Patreon, even though you can do that. And a few cool people like Damon do that, which is great. I don't say that, like, ever, because I don't like being advertised to, and so I don't advertise to you guys. You just get free chess all the time, which is great. So thank you for your tolerance as I pushed subscribing like mad. I appreciate that. <clears throat> and uh, I'd also like to say hi to Max VMV. I love your name because the VMV does look like a guy going, yeah, like this, like this. Hold on. 
like this. Yeah, this is like the V part right here. I like that. So cool, Max VMV. I like your name and I like the new setup, which is what you like as well. Pistachio 83, happy new year to you. Dark Saint 07 XL rifle. Yes, it's over, but you need to follow the Twitch stream because you'll get emails, which is, you just love emails, right? You'll get them when I stream, which is twice a week. Um, and then sometimes in between as well. So follow Twitch. Next thing we're going to do is hit a thousand Twitch followers. We currently have like 930 or something like that. It's not a thousand. That's not okay. So that's, that's the next milestone there for us there. And uh, if there's something you want to see on the show, like a variant, I love seeing your guys' ideas on, on the YouTube channel when you comment the variants. So if you type chess whiz in YouTube and then you're like, no, not cheese whiz, and then put some, put some comments on those videos with what kind of weird variant you want to see, I will definitely check those out. So see you next time.